Ta-da! My people, the Lord has given me commandments, laws, to give us some much-needed structure. Please pay attention, as I will only be going over this once. <clears throat> I am the Lord your You contradict God. everything I say. No, oh, I do not. Gentlemen, not do we have a problem here? We just had God. to get out of the sub-basement. Too many betrayals. Too much guilt floating around down there. It's been 25 minutes since your last crisis. What could have possibly happened? <laughs> Nobody touch me. Nobody touch me. Your underwear does not belong on the floor. It belongs on the outside of your pants. My legs, my legs, my legs are blind. My legs are blind. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. I'm guessing that a large part of what's causing you grief is that you've been dropped into an alien universe. So you are totally unfamiliar with our laws and policies. Everyone is trying to steal my hot plate. I just want to borrow it. It's the only one. Okay, okay, hold on. There is a rule that specifically addresses this in my code of backstage conduct. It says here, stealing is strictly prohibited. However, borrowing is allowed as long as you have the owner's permission in advance and it is returned promptly. So you see, this rule allows you to share with others without fear of being robbed. Oh, oh, I like that. See, rules can help us to all get along and work together. Now, let's go over the rest of the rules. And then I realized his new lamb was actually my old lamb that I thought I'd lost, but he'd actually stolen. That's not true. Never fear, my people. The Lord has provided a way to resolve this issue. You must... Going well? Yes, Miss Frederick. Miss Frederick, I broke rule number seven. Or was it rule number eight? And I'm covering everyone's limbs and torsos. Everyone! I now realize that every steel demerit logically ought to be accompanied by a covet your neighbor's goods demerit. So... Excuse me! Excuse me! Excuse me! <laughs> it's clear you've uncovered some complexities that the main rules don't fully cover. Fortunately, I have an expanded set of rules that were drafted for just such an eventuality. Section A, paragraph 1, line 1. Okay, God just gave us another important law. When an alien is in your land, do not mistreat them. So, basically, if we're ever invaded by space aliens, we need to bust out the welcome wagon for those little green guys. I think it's referring to people from other countries. Interesting theory. A little bit out there, but worth considering. Subparagraph 3, section 9, subheading 0, no shellfish. I don't quite remember writing that one, but I'm sure it's very important. Do not eat meat that still has the blood in it. For one, it's a health hazard. And for two, ew. Just ew. And finally, rule 613. Always remember to have fun. Any questions? I think that clears up everything quite nicely. Thank you for your time, Becky. Just please keep it down. Hey, real quick. Concerning the volume levels for karaoke, should we adjust? To factor in major holidays? Absolutely not. Absolutely not. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. The purpose of <coughs> the purpose of the laws is to expose sin and create order out of chaos, so that we can focus on what's truly important. Like karaoke volume levels? Dude, you're focusing too much on the law itself. We're not in a relationship with God because we follow the rules. We follow the rules because of our relationship with God. The laws are guidelines for living in a good relationship with God and each other. When we break the law, it's showing us that we're hurting those relationships. But the law is so complex. How can we remember all of it? I'm not saying we have to memorize all of them. It's the spirit of the laws that's important. Jesus had an elegant way of summing it all up. Love God and love each other. That's what's important. In that case, would you like to join us for dinner? As long as I'm not on the menu. <laughs> oh my gosh, the show! Todd, why aren't you on stage? We reached third intermission. It's going great, just two hours to go. What happened down here? Long story. <laughs>